Hello, my name is Derek Badala. I am here at MarkerTech, and we are talking about some new features to the RME Fireface series of audio interfaces. Specifically, in 2024, RME has added a room EQ and binaural crossfeed functionality. This essentially is DSP inside of the interface. So what you see here on the table is our flagship Fireface UFX3 connected via MADI to an M32 Pro Dante, uh, a D to A model, which would be a quintessential Dolby Atmos immersive audio setup, say in your studio, where you can have up to 32 analog outputs to whatever your setup might be. What you see on my laptop is the Total Mix software. This is actually running in the hardware where we can do an Atmos immersive audio setup, control the individual volume, apply individual output delay, individual volume calibration, and we have nine fully parametric EQs on all of the outputs. You can assign the EQs, the room EQ, to any output you want. So if you want to use the analog outputs, you can. If you want to assign this to your headphone outputs for stereo, you can. Or if you want to use the MADI outputs, which is what we're doing in this system, uh, we can do that as well. And you can assign the room EQ up to 20 outputs simultaneously, which is going to be perfectly adequate for Dolby Audio, Dolby Atmos, or immersive audio setups. So the setup you see here is uh, we're running Logic using Dolby Atmos 7.1.4 in the DAW through the Dolby renderer to the Fireface UFX3 with Room EQ applied. I have a couple of examples of the Room EQ up here on the window, um, and we can use things like Room EQ Wizard, Smart, SonarWork, Sound ID Reference to do the measurements ourselves and put them in, or we can actually hire that out and have somebody come in, a professional, and take the measurements. But you can put them in manually, you can import them, uh, and at the time of this taping, we're actually gonna have presets built into some of these software tools so you can import these measurements automatically and you don't have to manually put them in. Now, the unit you see in the rack that's lighting all up, that is the M32 Pro DA, so it's a digital analog converter. This one has Dante. So in our studio, we can go out of our DAW, into the room EQ, into the Fireface, come out of our interface and go into the M32 and dedicate the M32 to be our D to A system out to our Atmos setup. Now, we also have other packages that you can put together. For example, you could put just the UFX3, a UFX2, a Fireface 802 and use all of the built-in analog outputs on those interfaces, including the headphone outs on the front. Now the headphone outs are also capable of being line outputs and we certainly acknowledge that not everybody is going to want to use their headphone outs to do this type of setup, which is why we're using a secondary device as a, as a dedicated converter for the outputs. We also can use the Ferrofish Pulse 16 or A32 Pro Dante as our D to A converter and either go A to or MADI out of our interface uh, that way. Or I could take a Fireface UCX2 half rack interface, take a second interface, Fireface UCX2, put it in standalone mode and use the two devices together as one and take one through six analog out on the first, one through six analog out on the second and use that bundle or that package to do an Atmos setup at home, for example. But the room EQ and the crossfeed functionality is built into all of these Fireface models. And so you can build a system using any of these uh, that we've talked about. For more information, you can check it out uh, at the MarkerTech website and, or you can go to rmeusa.com. Thank you.